Thanks, Matt and Brian. I, I guess you'd say you guys earned that one. Yeah, we did. I, all the credit goes to uh, goes to the players. Uh, you know, not a lot of people gave us a chance with uh, two of our uh, our point guards out. With uh, Antoine Butler had a um, um, a appendectomy, emergency appendectomy, and and we have another player who's uh, who's out in concussion protocol. So um, Dylan O'Hearn came out uh, came up huge, uh, handling the ball for 40 minutes. And my man, you're going to talk to next had. You know, a game that I've been waiting for him to come out, you know, just to show his energy. You know, I don't care about the scoring. When we were good early on, Suli was doing a great job of rebounding, guarding the ball screens, and uh, getting his hands on shots. So, you know, he seemed to be all over the court getting deflections. Uh, went to him a couple times uh, at the end down low, and he was able to, to get to the rim and get baskets. So I'm just ho so happy for Suli. You know, he just worked so hard. He's the epitome of a student athlete. And all our guys, really. I mean, it was a great effort. I Al Nankin, who hasn't played, and he's in at the end of the game, and I'm yelling and screaming at him, <laughs> you know. So, uh, especially on that last turnover. But you know what? That energy, that effort, it really showed up with your defense at the three-point line. When you guys were winning games early, you're one of the better teams in the America East and in the country on three-point field goal uh, defensive percentage. And tonight, you really guarded the three. They were two of 22. What do you credit that to? Just uh, effort and energy, you know. Pat, uh, Pat does a great job at UMass Lowell. Our games always seem to come down to the, uh, you know, to, to 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 one or two possessions. So, um, you know, we knew they were coming off a big win against UMBC, you know, and uh, you know I, our guys played with the chip on their shoulders tonight. You know, being down a few guys, they just stepped up and made some great plays. So I'll let you get over to Suli though. He deserves it. Yeah, and Suli, you look like you played with the chip on your shoulder. I saw you before the game. You were smiling. I said you're ready to go and. And you actually, you felt like when I talked to you that you had some energy. How big was that first basket that you hit? You missed your first shot, but then you came back, hit that second. What did that do for your confidence? It gave me more confidence. Obviously, the last couple of days, I've been talking a lot with Coach. He was asking me to bring energy. That's the only thing he cares about. That's all I was about today, just bringing the energy. And then, like, he always tell me, like, things are going to come out when I bring, uh, bring the energy. That's what I did today. And it's funny, when you do bring the energy, the ball finds you. And now the next thing you know, you're making a – but those post moves, quick and aggressive. And you were demanding the basketball there late in that second half. How did that feel? It was good. Well, I was there just there playing, not thinking about everything. Just I was just thinking about bringing the energy, next play, next play, not thinking about whether I make it or miss it. We just, just go out there and play. That's what I did all game, honestly. Well, congratulations. It's good to see you earned it. Thank you for having me.